What's up guys, today I'm gonna to go through how to create this super cool effect where the subject is separated from the background using a letterbox effect. And the new feature in Final Cut Pro is gonna make this really easy to do. So for this effect, you're going to need a still video clip shot on a tripod or shot handheld and then stabilized. This one was shot handheld, so I'm going to have to stabilize it and use the tripod mode. So to do that, what I'm going to do is select the video clip, go over here to the parameters and and make sure stabilization is ticked. As long as the video clip is still enough, you'll be able to tick the tripod mode. And the tripod mode is pretty cool because it turns a handheld video clip into a completely still video clip that looks like it's shot on a tripod. At the end of this video clip, we have a clean frame without the subject in it. And that's really important for this effect if you want to do it the easy way. So make sure when you're filming your video clip, you have a clean frame without the subject in it. Okay, so next step, what I'm going to do is go over to my effects tab and go down to keying, mask and keying, and then I'm going to use the new feature called scene removal mask. And I'm just going to add this to the video clip and that's going to get rid of the background of the video clip. And it's done a pretty good job of doing that. Apart from a few shadows, we can easily get rid of those for this effect. So the next thing I'm going to do is copy and paste this video clip, hold down option, click and drag the video clip up. And then on the video clip underneath, I'm just going to go to the scene remove mask and untick it. And then I'm going to add a letterbox effect to this bottom video clip. So I'm going to go to my effects tab and search for the letterbox. So Final Cut Pro comes with this letterbox effect, um, but I'm going to use an animated letterbox which is a pretty cool plugin pack if you're looking for some new effects. I'll leave it linked in the description. And I'm gonna drag this blur open letterbox on. And I'm using this preset because we get this cool animation at the end. So now with this letterbox effect added, the subject comes out of the frame into the letterbox and it creates like this separation effect. So now the effect is pretty much done. It was super easy. There's a few little things I could do to perfect it. So one of them is getting rid of the shadow which comes below the letterbox here. And to do that, what I'm going to do is just add a mask to this top video clip. So I'm gonna to go to my effects tab and I'm gonna to go to mask and keying and drag on the draw mask effect to the top video clip. And then I'm just going to draw a mask around this shadow, go up to the parameters and click invert. Make sure the mask lines up with the letterbox effect. So now I've got rid of the shadow and it looks much better. Another thing I could do is clean up the mask this effect has created. It's left a slight outline on the subject. So for this, I'm going to use this matte magic effect. This effect doesn't come with Final Cut Pro, but I'll leave it linked in the description. So now going over to the parameters on the matte magic, what I can do is just turn up the shrink. It just shrinks the edge of the mask, just gets rid of that white outline and makes it the effect look a lot cleaner. And we have this bit at the end here. I'm not even sure what that is. So to get rid of it, I'm going to turn my top video into a compound clip. Just because it's stabilized, I don't want the stabilization to change. And a good way to do that is just to add it into a compound clip. And then I'm going to trim the edge. So we just get rid of that bit. And there we have the finished effect. Super easy to do with the new features in Final Cut Pro and a cool effect to add into an edit or a video. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Subscribe if you liked it and I'll see you in the next video.